All right, hey, what's going on, y'all? What's going on? So, um, we are gonna say grace and then we're gonna eat. Um, okay, dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive for nourishment. So, everybody, in health in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Um, if you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Uh, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and uh, leave us some comments down below. And also, don't forget to uh, and uh, I was gonna say hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Okay, so today. I've always I've had this um okay so today. today I've been trying I'm going to try and like do a little green screen okay so hopefully it works and you guys won't see um otherwise you're just gonna see this green land on my couch back there so I'm gonna see how it works out okay so today we're eating the hello fresh meal this is what is it it is what is the light the um rain light is really loud so you can't see the title but it's uh tuscan sausage and pepper spaghetti okay it's very good tastes like spaghetti um, what do you mean? It is spaghetti. No, I'm saying like it's a, re a recipe that we um, it's not my normal spaghetti, but it's good. I did add I added some um, at one point it had you put some water uh, so it's at one point where it had you add some um, some water to it. So I just added some more um, seasoning just so to make sure you know that the water didn't take it away. Mm. Um, I just added some garlic. And uh, Italian seasoning. It already had you seasoned with salt and pepper. I added some more salt and pepper though. Bubby man's over there. He was asleep. Uh -oh. Cheers. Oh. Cheers. Cheers. Move your pop out the way so you can see your plate. I added some sugar too because some because Gavin likes um I mean it's not like he won't eat savory spaghetti but I make it sweeter so that he'll like it. Uh -huh. It's all right. But not better than my mom's. Okay, all right. I um my mom's is the best. Oh I was well, thank you. I cooked with so, my two favorites are my dad and Aaron's, and it's my mom. My dad puts pep um I think he said he put onions in there. Meat. Well it might be meatballs, but I don't I forgot. Definitely spaghetti. But I think it's red pepper, orange pepper and yellow pepper. I hate putting there. Yeah, one day he, he gonna come home talking about some. Yeah, my dad's spaghetti is. I just really love his because it's got pepper and onions in there. I was like, I put pepper and onions in my spaghetti, you know. He was just trying to act like his was the best. Like, I don't cook for him all the time, you know. I feel some type of way about it, too. That's okay. He was saying, you know, you know, just really asking like it was the best spaghetti he ever had in his life. And I'm just like, really? It's good, though. I mean, it was a nice, simple recipe. Um, spaghetti is pretty simple, you know, unless you're making it, well, you know, unless you're making it from scratch. scratch. One day I do want to make, like, my own, like, homemade spaghetti sauce. Mm. 
So right. we've been um, just chilling today. We were going to go see Spies in Disguise, but we couldn't because um, my mom had to sit by me to see me. Uh, yeah, we got there at the three fifty. We wanted to go to a show, and you know, we got there right at the time that that specific specific showing was starting, and they didn't have any seats for us to sit together. Like, I like to sit. Don't come for me, okay? I like to sit in the wheelchair row, like, um, or whatever, because I can put his stroller, like, where a wheelchair will go, a Bubby stroller, and then, you know, me and Gamma sit in the seats or whatever. Yeah. And uh, they didn't have any seat. They had the stroller and a companion seat available, but they didn't have, like, another seat next to the companion seat available. So we'll just go. We're going to go in the morning. We're gonna go. We could have went to the next showing, but that showing was the regular prices. Then mm -mm. I'm all about the five dollar like Cinemark. You can go. You can see a movie <coughs> for five dollars. It used to be five dollars before six. Now they didn't change it to five dollars before four, and it was at three fifty five showing. And I was like, oh no, I'm not paying these regular prices because I've been used to paying. They said they changed it from to five dollars from uh, before six, like. A couple years ago, so and then one day, I think the last movie when we went to go see Adam's Family, it was it wasn't five dollars, and I'm just like, ma'am. Mm -mm. I mean, I'm in. well, what? Because before then, before Cinemark changed from five dollars to four six, we were only going five dollar Tuesday. Cause I mean, it just gets expensive when you go and then you paying for stuff at the concession stand, getting popcorn and drinks or whatever. Cause you know these kids, these new age kids, just spoiled. Mm -hmm. On top of paying almost, you know, however much, like upwards of twenty bucks for tickets, like mm -mm. I um I went to this one this one mall um, named Easton here. I think one time I went and paid like definitely twenty dollars for me and Gavin to go see a movie. I'm just like that's ridiculous. Like, and I think that his ticket was like almost as much as mine, if not as much as mine. I'm just like, well, why? Why the kids' tickets this expensive? You know. Oh yeah, we went to Legoland in Atlanta like two years. I think it was two years ago. Bubby man, so I cooked. And no, when do we get this big movie, movie? I don't know. Can't recall. I do have a picture on my tablet. I mean, a video, but I probably won't tell the date. My mom, she hooked me on to the five before six because she used to take her, him, and my nephew to the movies all the time every kid movie that came out she would take them and then she discovered the five four six or whatever what else was i about to say to y'all i forgot i don't see that happen that she oh sometimes when she's on the phone with um papa she don't, they don't be talking about nothing. It's true. So, I think I told y'all before, but so I used to have this, what I've di self-diagnosed myself as a fear of not getting fooled. So, if I went somewhere and I knew that they wasn't going, like, you know, I wasn't going to get enough food, I will always get more than one dish. And, um, that's why I like the cheesesteak factory so much, because their portion sizes are so huge that I normally get full. Or whatever I get. Well, anywho, I just thought about that because I was wondering if this was going to be enough food or not. Like, I was like, dang, we might... Might have to eat, go and eat some leftovers after this, especially with this one, because he be acting like he be starving. You know what I'm saying? I be trying to eat my food too. 
Oh, that's why I'm gonna tell y'all that I um, while I was cooking, I had Bubby in my carrier and my little baby carrier that I got, and he fell asleep while I was cooking. But then as soon as I took him out that thing, he woke right on up. I guess it was very soothing for him to be in there. I had one with Gavin, but I don't know. I don't think I had the right never, one because I really I didn't did. wear it. It was like, I mean, there's so many more brands now. And maybe it was more brands back there, back then. But like Baby Bjorn was like a, the really popular brand when I had him. And I think it was like, it had to be like 50 bucks or something. I just didn't want to pay for that. <laughs> so I got a little $20 one from Walmart maybe. But I don't know if I, I don't know why I didn't wear it. Maybe I didn't think that he was comfortable or it, I don't know. At first I thought Bubby was going complain act crazy about being there but he did fine clearly because he fell asleep so yeah this is my second one in the box hello first box that i didn't want <laughs> the last one i thought it was birds but it's actually some sort of meatballs it's like a, I think it's like Asian themed meatballs and rice. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited. Um, while I was at, so while I was at work, um, still, there was some, um, my coworkers did the uh, Death Nut Challenge. It was like, it was like, it was either between six and eight people that did it or whatever. It was super funny. What was that like? <laughs> uh, excuse me. Some people were pretty cool. Ooh, buddy. Juicy. Let's splice it. Some people were, like, you could visibly tell. I mean, just, you know, just their bodily functions, like, you know, sweating or whatever as they got higher, or they got higher up. But even before the end, I think, you know, just watching, like, clearly. I know y'all, like, why she talking about her all the time? With, I just um, love them so much. But wait a sec. We're going to do it with No, me. we ain't going to do it. Me and my brother are going to do it. It's going to be too hot for you. I'm not going to let you do it. Um... We, it's too hot for Grayson, and he can't even eat it, too. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh, I was say, I know y'all talk time me talk about her, but I just love their family so much. I watch them like I literally watch her videos like every day, every day. And so I sent, first seen the challenge when they did the Death Nut Challenge, and then then my coworkers did it, and then I was like, yeah, I'm definitely doing that. And then somehow. Uh, Excuse me, it ended up being like I seen it on my Facebook feed. It was like two for 20. Like, so I was like, oh, that's a, that's a steal because I think I want to say one packet of them is $20 or something like that. I don't know. Anywho, I got the two. For I got it. It came across my Facebook feed of uh, advertisement for it. So, um, me and my brother will do it. And I was, I was waiting till he came back because when I first started this channel, he was over, um, in Kuwait and, um, but I knew that I was going to have him do all these hot challenges with me. And I told him, so he, he going to do it. Um, the first time I tasted the two two time, two time spicy noodles, we him and, I, him and I did. Like, a, we went on Facebook Live and ate them. It was super funny. We split a pack. And then I shipped the pack. I shipped the rest of them to somebody else because I knew I wouldn't eat them no more. That's the only one that I need to try one time in my life. And I was trying to see how I could like get the video so I could like post it on my YouTube so you guys can see it, but I don't know if I can like download it or whatever. So. These are the last of the, fan, of the pineapple fantas, y'all. Um. Uh, 
yet, so I'm excited to do that. So we're gonna see. Well, I don't know when he's gonna be ready, but whenever he's ready, I'm gonna do it. Um, and then, I mean, we're gonna be doing all them little hot challenges that I, I've seen. Um, like the devil's toe, we're gonna do that one. I'm a little key scared for that one though, but we're gonna do it. Um, and I wanna do the one chip challenge. I'm definitely scared about that one. You not doing, you ain't doing none of these, bruh. It's too hot. I know. <clears throat> if y'all watch me love Darius, was like. <laughs> yeah, he was screaming. That's like, like literally, I'm in tears when I watch that. Like, it's super funny. Um, are you gonna finish this? No. So. But you can have it. They ain't gonna be talking about the crying, talking about he hungry. Well, y'all, we gonna probably get some dessert, like cookies or something. How you gonna get some dessert? And you ain't ate all your, you ain't, you all you did was ate the spaghetti out of here. I will eat some more of this. You gonna eat some, some more. You, you that? see, now you see, he ate a whole, whole medium sized pizza from Domino's, but now. Cause it, this ain't what he really want to eat. He ain't trying to eat it. Y'all see how kids do? Thank you. Uh, oh, excuse me. Oh. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. And so the type of sauce, it's just some sweet Italian sausage. It's the sausage that they had me use. Really simple, just cut up. Um, so you had to cut up a uh, pepper and some and the onions and some parsley. Cook the peppers and onions, add the sausage in there. They would cook the peppers and onions with this Tuscan seasoning or whatever. Which is why it's Tuscan sausage spaghetti. Only, only spaghetti I would really eat is my mom. My mom's on my task, but freshest is the it's just not the best. Um. Um, and then, so one of my cousins, they made this um, chicken one of Thanksgiving, and they made some chicken yesterday. Oh, Christmas. But I'm going to get my uncle back in Madden. I can't tell, I can't tell y'all whose team I'm going to be on because he going to know, and I don't want him to know. I want him it's to be a surprise. Okay, y'all, I'm pricking the browns. Just don't if he don't pick them first. <laughs> Cause he a die, he a die hard browns pick. Either I'm the Green Bay Packers or I'm gonna use um, the Vikings. Mm -mm. Yeah, so like I said, hopefully, so like I said, hopefully this green screen, I mean, hopefully it picks it up or whatever, and otherwise it's going to be looking crazy. Y'all just going to see this green land back here, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I mean, it's cool. Uh, it's okay, bet y'all still going to see this video. Okay. Okay. Oh. All right, y'all, we about to peace out. Again, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, definitely subscribe to our channel and uh, hit that bell so you get next time we post a video and leave some comments below. Let us know, you know, what's up. Let us know how we doing. And we're going to peace out. Mm, 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 mm.